Um, your shift Friday, yes? I made the reservation at the Burmese restaurant with uh -huh. My oh. shift doesn't start for half an hour. Okay, I don't have time to get ready now. I'm meeting Jack. Oh, Jack can wait. Jack is patient. Jack is way less fun than your you wife. You need to stop saying Jack's name <laughs> while you're naked. Yeah? I'm sorry, you want to give me a spanking? Um, okay. I am a woman of my word, and I work to do today, mm. so I can't. No. <sighs> Only half ten minutes. <laughs> you spent a year of your life studying the female orgasm. Ten minutes should be plenty. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? Potty? Potty. Okay, let's go to the bat. Let's go. Let's go to the bathroom. Yep. Oh God. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, oh my God. help! <laughs> She's leaking. Give her to me. Hello, Bella. <sighs> Should we get changed? Oh God, it's not so bad. <laughs> That's right. Everybody's poo-poo stinks. Even uh, Maya's. How are you so good at this? You never babysat? Oh, thank you. Oh, I had friends with kids. No. Nothing? No, why? Uh-huh. Uh-huh, <laughs> what? <laughs> Nothing, it just explains a lot about your personality. Once you spend a lot of time with kids, you realize that plans and rules and rigid diets don't really make sense when you're always two minutes away from an exploding diaper. <laughs> <laughs> We might need to change the socks too. Let's see what color we have. <gasps> Look at that! <laughs> Look at him over there. <sighs> Today was a lot for him. It was a lot for everyone. Yeah, it was a disaster. <laughs> it was a pretty beautiful one. It was. Mm. I mean, all of it. There were disasters happening in the kitchen mm -hmm. and in families and on the roof. And we're all in pain and heartbroken. Yeah. And yet, when there was a child in the building, we were all fine. When there was a child in my arms in the middle of it all, I was fine. We kept her fine. We knew how to keep her fine. We can do this. I can do this. Let's have a baby. Sorry, what? I want to have a baby. Okay, it's usually not best to make decisions while in mourning. I'm not, I mean, I am in mourning, but I've been thinking this whole time that I need to stick to some plan. But plans don't work. People die, families fall apart. Let's have a baby. Um, Karina, am I in the right apartment? Sorpresa. You are supposed to be at work. I'm not working for the next two days. <gasps> Why? Because we're making some homemade porn? No, it is romance, not mm. porn. But there is a lot of red. We're making a baby, and I want to have all the romance and all the sex that comes with making a baby. Even though we're picking a sperm donor from a very unsexy sperm bank. Exactly. Life has been so hard mm. and so difficult. Mm -hmm. And there's been so much pain and so much grief. I just think we need a little bit of something different. And you... I need a massage. Oh, I really do. But I go. Oh. And I am gonna be your very sexy massage therapist today. <laughs> oh, the surprises keep coming. Karina, this is... What? This is so romantic. <laughs> Oh, 
number two. It's freckles. It's a beauty mark. I can't think of blessings, not body parts. Well, I am feeling very blessed by your body parts. Number three. Mm. A healthy body. See? <laughs> Number four. Mm. You turning what could have been a day full of grief and housekeeping into the most romantic day of my life. Aside from our wedding. Well, that one got a little dinged by the whole losing my job thing. Mm, right. Uh, okay, number five. Hmm? Multiple orgasms. Mm. 